The year is 2047. After GRID successfully deflected asteroids from Comet 2047-5L1, it was discovered that they contained valuable materials, geodinium and nebulite. Your team is tasked to develop an autonomous rover to retrieve the novel astral materials. Introducing the competition. Introducing Mining Mayhem. The object of the game is to score the most amount of points possible by completing various tasks via an autonomous robot unit. Mining Mayhem is played on a four foot by eight foot field covered in eight foam tiles. The robot must start within a 12 by 12 by 12 inch cube, but can expand once the game has started. The robot must act completely autonomously for the entire game with no external communication. The game begins with the illumination of an LED with the robot starting in the landing site area and ends precisely three minutes later when the game will be scored. This year's field includes a cave for teams to navigate in order to search for astral materials. Teams will earn points for entering the cave. The astral materials are geodinium and nebulite. Both astral materials are 40 mm purple icosahedrons, however geodinium contains a dense magnetic core, making them weigh more than nebulite. The Mining Mayhem field has 18 geodinium and 16 nebulite randomly distributed between the cave and outside areas. There are two cosmic shipping containers, each 6 by 6 by 6 inches, one for geodinium and one for nebulite. Points are scored by collecting astral material and placing them in a cosmic shipping container. More points are earned if they are sorted into the correct cosmic shipping containers. Robots are allowed to freely move the cosmic shipping containers throughout the game. Prior to the start of the game, an April tag will be placed at the west end of the field. This telemetry reading will instruct the robot to place the cosmic shipping containers in specific rendezvous pads. Teams earn points for each cosmic shipping container that ends in a rendezvous pad. Teams earn additional points for each cosmic shipping container that ends in the telemetry communicated rendezvous pad. Robots can start the game preloaded with their team beacon. This team created element can be placed into the beacon mast to earn points and display their team spirit.